What makes a book great? Number one on Amazon? Top 4% on Amazon for over a year? Helps you make money. Impacts people in a positive way and gives them the tools to make it happen. But what makes a really great book? All of the above. Hi, Tracy Rapchuk here, the Marketing Makeover Maestro, and welcome to Day 5, How to Pick an Autoresponder. First, we'll start off with what an autoresponder is. This is the critical element to your internet marketing business, and without this piece of software that drives your database list building, you would not be able to participate in why we get into internet marketing, which is making money while we sleep. The reason we can do it is autoresponders, because they send out an email in a sequential fashion, one after the other, whether it be every seven days or every 10 days, whatever you set that number to be and it will do the work for you as soon as the person comes in to your subscriber and becomes part of your list then these emails will start to go out with no effort on your part whatsoever it is very important to take the time and pick the one that's right for you in general there are three autoresponders that I recommend for various and detailed reasons but I'll give you the summary overview now the first one is called a Weber and it is a great place to start and uh, track your users and it's great for corresponding with them the second one is called one shopping cart and if you are going to really get sophisticated and you want to track affiliates and you want to really uh, build a full business this is the probably the best one that you should go with if you plan on really making this into your career versus uh, really just kind of building a list and, and sending things out and then the third one is called auto response plus now the difference between the first two and the third one is the first two are hosted on another system which means you pay a monthly rate for those the third one auto response plus you host that on your own server and you pay a one-time fee for that and no matter how big you build your list it doesn't matter you have you know you can build it as big as you want without paying extra fees and without paying a monthly fee altogether the only thing you need to make sure with this one though is you have a unique IP address on your server so that you're protected and, and it's a good system for you. There is really the place for you to start and it is choosing the autoresponder that is best for where you want to take your business and where you think your business is going to be going because a lot of those systems the more power and the more subscribers that you have and need the more they start to charge you on a monthly basis. So it's just a question of where you want to start and where you want to get going but the key is to choose wisely now because it is extremely difficult to transport your list from one system to another and in some cases it's not allowed at all. So have a great day, choose your autoresponder wisely and I'll talk to you soon.